another video and this time I'm happy to be bringing a video to you where I actually get to speak to you this time. My last couple videos have mostly been vlogs of me traveling to and from school or clinicals so I'm glad that I finally get to put out a video where I get to talk with you instead of at you. Today's video is going to be a holiday gift guide to nursing students or really any other kind of health professional. Most of the gifts I've picked up can be tweaked to fit someone that's also in PA school or med school or even like physical therapy or like OT, whatever works for them, whatever they're interested in. But a lot of these gifts can just be altered to help. So before I get into the actual gift guide, I'm going to talk about four things that I think are important and I do have my phone with me so if you see me looking down it's just that I have notes. So in choosing gifts for a nursing student or any other allied health profession, there are four things that I think are important to remember when thinking of a gift or purchasing a gift. Um, the first is practicality. Is this something that they're actually going to use or something that is just going to sit in a box and collect dust somewhere or just kind of look cute on a shelf? Two, relevance. Is it actually relevant to the profession that they're going into? Um, so if it's nursing related, is this something that a nurse will use? Personality. Does it fit their personality? For example, I know I'm not one of those girls that's super in love with pink, so if someone got me a pink watch or a pink stethoscope for Christmas, I'd be appreciative, but I'd also ask them, why would you get something that you know I probably wouldn't enjoy as much as something else? You know what I'm saying? And the last thing is creativity. How much thought have you actually put into it? Is this a generic gift that you kind of just picked up somewhere that was like, here, Merry Christmas, or Happy Kwanzaa, Happy Hanukkah, or is this something that you really put thought into? So those are the four things that you really need to think about before purchasing your gift for your nursing student. So let's jump right into it. So the first thing I would recommend is a travel mug. As a nursing student, that person would be traveling to and from their school as well as clinical sites and maybe other locations for educational purposes. And they'll probably be getting up early. And if they are a connoisseur of hot beverages such as coffee or tea or even like hot chocolate, a travel mug will be perfect because it'll keep their drinks hot or cold as long as possible. And a great recommendation I would say is the Yeti mug. It has a a lot of great reviews on YouTube as well as other online websites. Feel free to do your research. I'm gonna have all the links below for all the items that I mentioned just so you have more reference guides. But a travel mug would be a great idea and you can also have that personalized. There are a lot of sellers on Etsy and other websites like that who can personalize mugs for any profession or even occasion. The second gift I could recommend is a nurse tote bag or a lunch box. So I personally carry my lunch almost every day to class when I'm staying on campus all day or to clinicals. One, to save money and two, I'm always going to prefer the food that I prepare versus something I buy. And it would be so cute to have like a cute little lunch bag that has my initials on it or even a tote bag that I can take to clinicals with me that has my initials on it. Something very personal, something very practical um, and it's also creative and it's easy to use and it's also very accessible. Again, you can look on websites like Etsy to find something that fits the needs of the person you're trying to buy the gift for. Okay, the third gift is your good old fashioned stethoscope. We all need one, every health profession. The brand that most people tend to go with is a Lipman, but do your own research, see what fits the needs of that person. I know there's like an Echo stethoscope, but I do believe that one is more expensive than a Lipman, but it is an investment, so again, do your research. They can range anywhere from 50 bucks to like three or four hundred dollars, but the great thing about these stethoscopes is that you have them personalized so that they don't walk away if you know what I mean. But another great gift for a nursing student. The fourth thing I would recommend is a nursing clipboard. When we are in the hospital, we're writing down notes, writing down vitals, other things that our nurse is telling us that our physician is telling us or whomever. We want to have something to write on. That's one thing that can be kind of difficult. I do carry a notebook with me around clinicals, but a lot of times I'm pressing and I'm writing into my hand and it can get annoying. I think a clip would be a great gift, it's something that they can use while they're in school as well as once they get their first job and jobs way after that. The particular clipboard I'm talking about is the, it's the white coat board. It retails for about $30 and um, 
It comes in different formats. The specific one I'm talking about in this video is the one directed towards the nursing profession. It has a lot of great notes on the back, so if the person that you're writing a gift for needs to reference something really quickly, they don't have to whip out their phone or go ask someone. It's right there on the clipboard. And it also folds in half and fits in most nursing pockets, or they can just leave it on there. It'll push cart if necessary. But it's a really great resource, and it's fairly inexpensive, a great holiday gift for any nursing student. Okay, the fifth gift that I have is your NCLEX preparation book. So that can be your Saunders book, which is what I use, or your Lippincott book. Both of these have really great reviews. These are just two that I'm mentioning in this video. There are so many out there that you can research to suit the needs of that individual. But anyone would appreciate an NCLEX review book. Um, the NCLEX is the exam that all nurses must take to be able to practice in their state. And we all have to face the beast and we all need resources to help us. So it's also great to have these resources while you're in nursing school so that you can prepare early. Again, I'm going to have all of the prices and links to these items listed in the description box below. The sixth gift that I would recommend is, of course, an NCLEX review course. We've already talked about the books, but there are actual courses that you can purchase a subscription for dedicated to preparing students for the NCLEX. And there are hundreds out there. The three that I'm just going to mention in this video seem to be the most popular. So those are Kaplan, Hearst, and UWorld. But like I said, there are so many other services out there that you can use. Do your research. This is just a general gift guide. There's still tons of research that needs to go into picking the right gift for that person. These subscriptions can range anywhere from a month to two to three, even four years. So purchase a subscription that you can afford or that you feel would best suit the needs of the person you are buying the gift for. The seventh gift that I would recommend is, is you can actually pay for their state boards. This is a quick disclaimer about this gift. Um, this gift would only really apply to nursing students that are towards the end of their education and nursing students that attend a nursing program where the cost of the NCLEX is not already factored into their tuition. Some schools will take the price of the NCLEX in advance so that once the student gets towards the end of the program, they know that that student is not going to have to scramble to find those funds somewhere. They already have the money because it was placed into their tuition. But if they attend a program like mine, where I have to shell out for the cost of my state boards, this would be a great gift. Where I live, the state boards is anywhere from four to five hundred dollars, and that's very expensive. Um, you don't have to pay all of it, of course. You can pay parts of it, half of it. Something is better than nothing. But again, this gift would probably only apply to students that a attend a program where the cost of the state points is not factored into their tuition or paid for in advance and two a student that is towards the end because it really makes no sense to pay for something at the beginning of nursing school if you get what i'm saying but again still a great gift for anyone who fits that criteria okay the eighth gift that i would recommend is sneakers or clogs for nursing students when i shopped for my first pair of clinical shoes i did not realize how expensive nursing shoes were i thought they were like 30 or 40 dollars but no nursing shoes are upwards of like 70 to 90 dollars which is very expensive for someone like me who pretty much paid for most of this on my own so purchasing a really great pair of shoes for nursing school is very important especially in the clinical setting when you will be standing for hours upon hours i know at my program our clinicals are 12 hours i'm there when the nurse gets there and we most of the time we leave together it's a lot of standing and it can really tire out your legs and your feet so great nursing shoes would be a great investment now if that's a little too pricey for you you can go down to like insoles that you just insert into shoes that they may already have another great option and if that's still a little bit too pricey for you compression socks are also another great gift they keep your feet from getting so tired and swollen and even your legs too at the end of the day and it's just something that every nurse and nursing student should look into purchasing night holiday gift that i would recommend are just nursing school resources in general and this is different from the NCLEX review, the NCLEX books, because those are geared more towards passing the state boards. So what I'm talking about now are resources that will help get that person that you're purchasing for to the end of nursing school and to the NCLEX. 
So that could be purchasing a subscription service like Picmonic or uh, Your Best Grade. I actually have subscriptions to both of these and I will do a separate video reviewing my thoughts and opinions on them. But that's just one idea or you can get them like RN notes, like a cute little notebook that you can take with you to clinicals or keep in your pocket and it has a lot of great resources in it. I'm out and insert a picture somewhere around here so that you can see what I'm talking about. If the person that you're purchasing for attends a program where they use HESI or Evolve resources, there are tons and tons of Evolve resources on the website that you can purchase that are like 25 bucks. It's just like extra questions and modules that they can do to help really get them through different body systems to make sure that they understand it. Great resources for nursing students. I would highly recommend that. There's also drug cards if you know your student will be taking the farm. It's like a little bucket that you can use. I feel like every nursing student has seen this before, but another great resource. You don't have to go with any of these ideas, but something in that realm. And the 10th gift is kind of like the holy grail gift that encompasses all the four things that I mentioned before, and it is a nursing school survival kit. This is something that you can make, you can put it in a basket, you can put it in a shoebox, you can put it in a shopping bag, or even a brown paper bag. Whatever suits your needs, and it can be as inexpensive or as expensive as you would like it to be. And I've listed 10 things that you can put in that nursing school survival kit. So you can put hand sanitizer in there, everyone needs hand sanitizer. You could also put like really cute lotions in there. Um, we wash our hands a lot, so having a really good moisturizing lotion Great. You can put disinfecting wipes, you can put a really good chapstick or lip balm. If they drink coffee or tea, you can give them like a gift card to Starbucks, Dunkin' Donuts, or Krispy Kreme, or wherever they like to get their beverages from. You can also get them like a gift card to their favorite breakfast place or just food place in general. I know when I was in nursing school, there were a lot of late nights where I wished that I had a gift card to run to Panera or something like that. I would definitely recommend getting a healthier option, not like a gift card to Burger King or McDonald's or something like that. You can get them an eye mask to block out at lights, so they can get some rest, earplugs, some aromatherapy, whether that's like scent beads or, or even a really wonderful candle like I know I love vanilla so I light a vanilla candle and I have on my mask and I have on my earplugs I'm out and the last thing that you can put in there is if they are a reader which I don't know how many people have time to read other literature outside of nursing literature while they're in school but if that's the person that you're uh, purchasing for you can get them like a motivational book or a devotional book or just write them a heartfelt letter saying how proud you are of them and tell, motivating them to keep forward and it could be something that they could read when they feel really discouraged because every nursing student gets to that point where they're just like I feel like the world is on my shoulders and I'm getting beat down to the ground all right guys that was my holiday gift guide for nursing students let me know if you liked it give it a thumbs up if you like some of my ideas if you end up purchasing something or you receive something for Christmas please comment down below I really want to know and as always thank you for subscribing hi to all my new subbies I really appreciate it if you have any other content ideas let me know I love interacting with you guys comment like subscribe share my videos and I will see you in the next one